Well, hello, Bob Dendry here, and welcome back to The Surge. We're here again in Central Production B, so it's been a, a bit of a long time coming, um, actually making it out of this area. But we've unlocked a lot of shortcuts last week, and we also helped out Irena Beckett with a staff, so hopefully our good deeds will be rewarded. So let's get moving. Um, happy Tuesday to you all. We usually put out um, The Surge on Mondays, but a little bit late this week. Um, been a pretty busy weekend with um, obviously lockdown finishing um, a couple of weeks ago here in New South Wales. But I'm ready to play some Surge, so this will be out tomorrow. I'm recording it on Monday. And um, yeah, really keen to see if we can make some progress. I also want to give a big shout out to uh, my Buy Me A Coffee supporters. Their names are down below. If you're interested in supporting, have a look at the link in the description. But obviously enough about that. Let's get into the game. Alright, so this is the area we got up to at the end of the last episode. So... Oh, man. <laughs> um... Why is that guy not there? Okay. Alright, so this is the part of the uh, level that we got up to at the end of our last episode. So it's been a long time coming with a lot of um, shortcuts and stuff unlocked. I think we went through, well, about three or so last episode. So yeah, definitely, um... Oh, definitely a lot of work was required. <laughs> but we did make it in the end. Which is good. Um... Oh, we've got Old Mate over here, um, which we need, I think, 5,000 tech scrap for, I think it was, which we don't have anywhere near enough at this point. on it. Stepping on the uh... Yes, nice. Easy peasy. What else? I recall I got killed as soon as I walked around the corner last episode. Yep. But not this time. Um, I've got new messages over here, so let's have a look and see what they've got to say. To all Sector 12 employees, I, I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but unlicensed gambling violates federal and state law, and thus places Creo at a not insignificant risk of criminal charges and liability. So, all raging drone events are to be cancelled immediately. Borrowed drones and other company equipment can be returned anonymously. 
Don't make me the bad guy here. I love a good drone fight as much as the next guy, but what we're doing here is too important to risk infractions of this nature. R. Ferguson. <laughs> uh, drone fights. I mean, it seems reasonably humane compared to what, you, you know, they could be using to fight, but... Fair enough. Oh, man, we've got a liquidator and an arc welder. Not my favorite people in the world. I'll tell you that much. Uh, we might just see if we can get past them. No, stop following me, mate. This is not going too well. Oh, we have an ops? Oh, f***. Oh, no! Ah, oh, so close. Just need to get to that ops. All right. Oh, far out. This is not good. <laughs> Oh no, not an authorization process. Okay, <laughs> I think we escaped them all. So I definitely saw a sign saying there was an ops nearby and that will be a good thing if we can get there. Um, we just need to find where it is. There's like nothing up here. Right? Uh, okay. Well... Hopefully, all those enemies that sort of chased us into this area have now, um, I, I guess, returned to their sort of regular hangout areas. I'm feeling like probably not. Look, we're going to have to find someone, so we may as well make it this guy. Yeah, it didn't go too well. Okay, um, we came down here. We have an overcharged circuit here, so let's get that running. Oh, okay. There's the ops sign. Is this the elevator? Yeah, okay. So hopefully this will take us to ops. And not to a premature death. Material Depot. Okay. Oh, excellent. Okay. Cool, so we're back here. Excellent, excellent, excellent. So let's, um... I might just run back to Ops then and, um... Deposit this... Scrap. Forgot where. Good to see you. Not good to see you. Oh, 
All right. Hello. Hello. Um, okay, so let's drop off our tech scrap. Um, do we have any consumables? We've got a couple. So let's bank those as well. So I wonder if we can go back to... Um, for your fellow workers. They look out for you. The lady in the pipe if our tech scrap that we want to give her is banked. Oh, damn. Tuffy. Get out of here. Okay, well, we've unlocked the elevator now, so that's really good. Um, that saves us a whole lot of scurrying around. And I think we're pretty much coming up to a boss battle now as well, because we did see when we were watching that uh, message on that terminal talking about the raging drone <laughs> um, betting stuff that um, there was a, quite a large drone running around in the background that looked like he was uh, ready to, to give us a red hot go. Okay, so we got, we now have leg schematics for the uh, liquidator set. Um, I think that's the whole set now that we can do. Okay. Got a door that's not working, another door that's not working, at least from this side. And what is next? I'm not giving up on you. Oh, hey Ben Burke. I won't hear it said that Benjamin Burke let down his team. I've marked the way to the outbound station. That's nice. There's big red letter saying exit. Even you can't, Mrs. Smithy. <laughs> okay, thanks, mate. Endurance Enhancer. That sounds helpful. Um, so what do you reckon of this big open area? Oh yeah, exit. Okay, I do see that. Um, I just want to go back now that we've overcharged that uh that circuit there Let's see if we can open these doors now and i wonder what they open okay oh there you are Okay, um, if I'm not mistaken, yeah, this goes back to um, so sort of that area where we finished the last episode. And this looks like promising for a shortcut of some sort, potentially. We may as well give it a go. <laughs> See where it leads. Okay. Another vital boost.
Okay, so it was just picking up that uh, implant, that's fine. Nothing like a good bit of bonus implant. Uh, that's where we came in, and that's it. Okay. Yeah, fair enough, I'm happy with that. Open that up just in case we need to use it later. Um, this one still locks. Fair enough. Alright, what do you reckon? Boss battle? Oh yeah, look. <laughs> there we are. Oh, okay. Let's do it. So far out. Please remain stationary during cleanup procedure. Oh, brutal. Okay, so I think we've, oh, hello, oh, nice, okay, so we got rid of one of our cool garbage disposal unit thing's legs, um, it's a good, good bit of progress, I feel like, for, you know, for the first, uh, try. I think I understand the pattern of this sort of, I guess it's probably going to just be the first part of this boss battle. And it's, you know, um, ooh, uh, just sort of bait the enemy into attacking you with one of its feet. And just ham, ham out on it. Oh, uh. But I did get a bit greedy there. Nice. Oh. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ugh. Ooh, yeah. Okay, so it gets a lot angrier when you get it down to three legs. <laughs> Fair enough. So it's a pretty straightforward fight for the first, um, I, I guess the first half, nice you would call day, that. Warren. But it gets a lot more difficult, um, it looks like, once you've uh, made it mad. <laughs> I think we're just going to try and note past all the enemies so we get there with um, all our uh, um, our health things still in hand because I think that will be very helpful. Uh. Alright, so I've decided to uh, take two of the vital injectors and see if um, that sort of helps us out a little bit. Um, uh, 
in terms of being able to do that sort of last little bit of damage because we get we, we're actually getting pretty close to um defeating it i feel like anyway oh brutal and he pierced God. Oh, wow. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, I think we can do it. I think we can do it. Let's have a look at our implants. Um, so we've got one spare power consumption. I'm just having a look and seeing what potential options do we have here? Sustaining array. I don't think we need the energy decay um, reduction. I don't think that's really helpful to us, to be honest. Mechanized counterweight. It's pretty good, but we have trouble sustaining energy as well, regardless, even with the uh, sustaining array. So I'm wondering, I mean, that's free actually, so we may as well keep it on. Omni Audit is free as well. So is there anything that's just one that will help us? Uh, we could do Vital Boost actually, so that'll increase our health a little bit more. It might give us just that... Oh, far out. <laughs> so just increasing the vital boost a little bit might actually help us. Um, just get that little tiny bit more health we need to be able to, to last through some of the attacks and tank them. Is it worth just giving it a go with one of our heavy weapons, like uh, the packs? Because I feel like we're not really... Mm hmm. I'll tell you what, we're going to give it a go with the Pax Sword. Um, I, I just feel like probably a single high damage attack is probably as useful to us here as a number of sort of low damage, low impact attacks. So we're, we're just going to give it a go on this run. And see if it is uh, any help to us. Oh, far out. Backed into the corner. <sighs> I think we might go with the pack sword again. Um, I sort of like stuffed up the approach because I took a lot of damage. So, and I think. By having one more vital boost or one more vital injection, I should say, is probably probably would be enough to beat it. So I'm really hopeful. <laughs> we've, I mean, we've been trying to fight this boss for like an hour now, so I think I think we're there. I think we're there. All right, let's do it. Let's defeat that fire bug.
Oh, fuck. Oh! <laughs> wow. Okay, that was a really quick, um... You know. Oh, nice. Down to one leg again. Oh, did we beat it? Oh, yes. Take that, Firebug. Oh, nice, 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 nice. <laughs> yeah, let's get, a, let's get a little selfie in front of it. Cool, all right, um... Ooh. So we've got the exit up there. That's what um, Ben Burke's been sending us towards. Well, let's have a look at the weapon that we've just uh, unlocked. The firebug throttles. So they are pretty fast. Low impact, high proficiency scaling, 5% energy gain. So they are probably a lot better than our... Uh, um, butterfly twin rigs. Well, on we go, I guess. Exit. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Goodbye. Um, we've got 5,000 um, thingamabobs. 5,000 scraps, so I really want to get back to the... Um, the woman in the pipe. need to remember where she is. I think we're going the wrong way. I'm definitely feeling that. But wow, these weapons. Wow. They are very nice. Um, nah. <laughs> nah, thanks. Okay, an audio log. I finally found our little thief. It's probably the same culprit who's been hitting the lab storeroom. She ended up dropping a pearl oh. on Biomaster in a hurry to get away. Looks like she was heading towards the old abandoned labs. I'll file a full report when I get back. 
Security can handle this one from here on out. Okay, so is that where we're heading? Towards the abandoned labs? I just want to check out the Biomaster that we just picked up, which isn't fantastic. Um, hmm. No, I really want to go back and give that, um, that lady in the pipe some, some scrap, because I feel like it's probably important. So we're going to go back up there, we're going to make our way back to Ops, and, uh, and then go out to get her. Hello. I have your scrap now. Yes. Guess I'm able to spare some. Thanks. I won't forget this. Okay. Need to make a move. In that case, I won't waste any more of your time. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. So that is all sorted out. We've got her the five thousand tech scrap she needs, and now let's make our way to the outbound station. Not that way, though. Okay. I'm sorry, but what? I just can't wait any longer. What do you mean? I hope you're okay. That you're still out there. That you found a safe place. I'm going to take the maglev to the old bio labs now. Try to get there if you can. I'll be waiting. Ben Burke. Thoughts and prayers are with you. Thoughts and prayers. You bastard. I can't believe you've done this. Okay. Um, train station is this way. Oh, Don. You heard me say it again and again, but Creo cares. Let's be honest. Over the last couple of decades, things haven't been too great. We know. We've seen the figures, and that's why we created Project Resolve. But with an ailing population, developmental problems, disability rising, and an alarming rate in children, some would have you believe it's too late. At least that's what elements of the media would have you believe. But Creo has you covered. From family daycare centers full medical coverage. Your family is our family. The average workplace can be littered with hazards. But at Creo, we're proud to say we never had more than a stuff zone. With the implementation of our rigs, we've made you stronger, faster, tougher. The rigors of the workplace won't even give you pause. And due to the integration of your neural interface into Creo's core system, our professional healthcare staff can monitor your well-being 24-7. If that doesn't make you sleep tight, I don't know what would. Thanks, Don. What a champion. Okay. So, here we are. Okay, so we're at the biolabs. What's over here? Excellent, love a bit of tech scrap. It's always good to see. And we have our ops coming up as well. 
hopefully uh, we can get there without being skewered by any of our friendly co-workers. It looks like it's just up these stairs. That's good. Warning, this is a quarantine zone. Please remain in operations until all potential sources of danger have been eliminated. Yeah, righto. Okay. Um, do we have new messages? We sure do. I'm freaking out here, Doc. Security is everywhere, but there's no change in the workers. It's still chaos. If anything, it's getting worse. I'm going to try and make a break for one of the loading bays. Hopefully I can get out. Uh, best of luck, Doc. Yeah, that doesn't sound promising, does it? Okay, new implant. This communication device is locked down. All lines blocked. Uh, fair enough. And guessing... Oh, we can use gear assembly. Excellent. That's a lot of broken parts to uh, recycle. Okay, and I'm thinking it's time to complete our our uh, scarab armor set. I just want to have a look at the uh, liquidators. Yeah, they don't seem fantastic. I don't think there's really much use uh, using those. Instead, we'll yeah build two scarab legs. I know we can only build one. <laughs> okay. Um, thank you. Just have a coffee brought to me. How good is that? Okay. Um, what we'll do then, we'll upgrade our core power. Oh, that gives us an implant slot as well. Excellent. Um, so that... Hang on, sorry. I'm getting confused in my old age here. So can we... No, we still need another... Oh, okay. Um, that's alright, we've got some consumables. It's fine. So we can... Um, Upgrade our core power by one more. No issues there. Okay, so we can... Yep, perfect. And can we destroy this one? And will we get... Um, what did we get for that? Did we just get tech scrap? Or did we get um, the... No, we just got tech scrap. Okay. What else have we got available here? I'm thinking we definitely want to be upgrading the uh fire bug throttles but we need mark 3 tungsten alloy for that all right so we're partially upgrading the scarab set anyway but i think that's going to be it for this episode it's been a long running one um but we did manage to get some progress we have defeated the fire bug um which was a little bit tough but i think um, switching to the single rigged heavy weapon was probably the best way to go there I think the the light quick weapons just didn't have the stopping power needed to take it out but that will be it for this episode of the surge so I hope you've enjoyed it if you have please give the video a like subscribe to the channel and ring that notification bell so you get a ding to your device the next time I post a video have a look in the description of this video there are links to the discord server all my social media please get on there you know, join, follow, subscribe, share, all of that stuff. Um, if you're interested in financially supporting the channel, have a look at the Buy Me A Coffee link, but that's enough of that. Until the next episode of The Surge, I'm Bob Dendry. Thanks so much for watching and goodbye.